Alright, everybody, let's continue our adventures of uh, recruiting. We are about to, of course, lose our outpost from Jabba. Jabba came in full force, but we should be able to retake it very quickly after that. Having, of course, now an army that is very weak, actually. Not only number wise, also rank wise. Ironically enough, in theory, this army should be able to take over that outpost uh, unless Jabba actually stationed his fleet over there. There we go. Let's see. One thing that I find very funny is that I sometimes also get some comments of people who actually just started watching this series all the way from the beginning. So, you know, you, those guys have a long, long journey ahead of them, full of uh, twists, turns, frustrations, happiness. Pretty cool, though. I'm still, I'm so happy with how well this series is doing. I mean, the, the first episode has over 11,000 views. It is, it is insane. And game-wise, or in, in when you compare it to in-game time, we're almost a year into the game. And we got a long way ahead of us, people. Ironically, though, and I talked about this with the Total War games as well, usually games tend to be more difficult uh, as you continue, right? The bosses become more challenging, enemies become tougher, blah, 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 even though you theoretically get sometimes new moves or new movesets, new abilities, blah, blah, blah. It becomes more difficult, more of a challenge. Here, and for example with real-time strategy, as you actually are able to create bigger armies, more units, the and, and actually eliminate certain factions, you will actually... Hold on. The game will actually become easier. So I'm not saying that we're at that point yet. That will be a long, long time, people, before we, we're, we're at that point. However, um... You know, in theory, eventually, we will actually have dominance and be able to quickly take out several outposts and hopefully several planets. See, that is exactly what I'm talking about. Just a minor setback really, really doesn't um, put a chink in our armor too much. Some people advise me to actually play as Kyle himself to level him up. Uh, I won't do that because I will, um... I want to roleplay a little bit since I have all these choice here. Kanoa's new order, so I want to play as myself. But, <clears throat> I, uh, I thought, well, why don't you guys, or why won't we go look for another hero unit? You know, so, pe so many people always swear by the hero units. If we get a girl or a guy and give him another lightsaber, good armor, we will have somebody who does a lot of damage as well. See, Kyle is doing a very good job on his own, currently, I think. Uh, yeah, hold on. Because this is always weird to me. Stationing... Patch knock! Oh yeah, that's what I was talking about. Somebody made a very good point, and something that I overlooked last time. I, I, I was surprised by how long it uh, actually took for Patch knock to um, come in, and, and, you know, he actually never did because Jabba attacked. But somebody made a good point with that there's a chance that one of my commanders might be captured. Now, I assume I get a message of that 
I don't know, or assume it, it does. But that was a good point. That was something that I, I didn't actually think about, that, you know, my commanders can, or my generals can be captured just like I can capture important characters of other, fa other factions. What's also very cool, obviously, is that they will actually try and uh, fight other patrols, apparently. So, hold on. We, I was talking about that we were going to look for another unit, so actually, let's first go here. Coralian Moon. I have some people to upgrade, though. Very cool, by the way. 90 people that we can now recruit. We have, we have the magic number. Now magic, the next magic number, obviously, is 100. And I think, in all my experience with the Mountain Blade franchise, and then I'm talking about a regular one as well, um, I've never actually had more than, I think, 105 or something troops in my army. Then again, when I played Mountain Blade first, I didn't actually use the Battle Sizer, so... It was a different experience overall as well. Maybe that's also why I stopped because even though it was still exciting to play, the battles felt, you know, like I experienced them to the max since, you know, the maximum number of units always spawned in. No. Was interesting. Usually when a person talks to me, it's either because he's going to pay me to kill someone. Because someone else has already paid me to kill him, and he's begging me not to. Or because he's very stupid and does not know exactly how dangerous it is to waste my time. I'm a hunter, a damn good hunter. Probably the best you'll see. I'm in Chani, or at least half uh, Echini. Can't speak for my father, I'm sure you know uh, how it is. But I can slip a vibro knife through whatever defenses you think you can offer. Darkness, seclusion, dure steel, blasters, lightsabers, whatever. There's always a weak spot in their armor. There's always a sound in shadows, there's always a hole in their form. But that's beside the point. Client, prey, or fool, which are you? I have a slightly different position if you hear me out. Uh, I see. So you're a mercenary. Not really. I'm a fucking faction leader, bitch. Well, now there's an interesting proposition indeed. The. Is it a guy or a girl? I'm not too sure. Uh, the petty crime lords and delinquent gamblers I usually hunt aren't a challenge at all. They can't fight back, don't even know I'm coming. I'm a hunter, and what I do here is uh, scarcely hunting at all. It's more murder, and murder isn't very interesting at all. Well, if the pay is good, and if you promise me the opportunity to use my skills on a regular basis, I'm all yours, Captain. Boom. And, uh, oh. That's good, yeah, sure. Alright. So, to keep things a little organized, let's... This up here. Can I not talk? No, oh, apparently not. How many units do we have? Drop your weapon. You're on a red. What? Why should I? I'm a bounty hunter and you're my bounty. Wait, I don't have any investor. I spent two entire years trying to be a bounty hunter, but yet I have not caught a single bounty. Oh, it's not a matter of good of shooting and it's not a matter of chasing. I'm good at both. I simply can't remember a face, Captain, or much anything else, to be frank. I can't tell a Celestrum from a Toridorian. I once accidentally tried to turn my own aunt in for a bounty on Princess Leia. <laughs> Good! Forgetting to bring her blast. Jesus Christ. Wow, look at that, people. Well, I'm gonna recruit him. You guys said recruit, and I'm gonna recruit this apparently complete noob. But we're gonna make him into a killing machine. Look, I know, I just tried to arrest you, blah, 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 yeah, okay, no, 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 of course not, of course not, not uh, take me out to fight with you, and I'll put what credits I make towards for paying the huts. What? Yeah, see, so long as I keep you pointed in the right direction, I think you'll work well. Ah, he wants money as well. Okay. Now. One thing I would be curious to know, since I have played several Star Wars games, um, but that was a long time ago for some of them, is, you know, obviously I know who Kyle Katarn is from the fucking Jedi Knight series, uh, and also Dark Forces, but are there any other, like, famous characters that you can recruit here? Like Basila, which wouldn't make sense, so I 
you know, I assume that she's not here, but... Oh! Girl! Oh, f f I don't have any money. Alright, well... That's it for now. Hope, hope a lot of you guys are happy that I, uh... Recruited heroes again, since that's what a lot of you want. And I think I talked last time about that after we recapture this, that our next target would be the outposts at Hoth again. I'm not too sure what their weapons are. Yeah, this guy, this guy, this guy doesn't have shit. Uh, I sold that gun. I don't want to spend any money on that now because I don't have a lot. We will probably loot something again. Pre oh, God. Well, here's an opportunity right now because I will get some stuff from here. Hello, boys. So, there is a um, mod which plays in uh, World War Two or actually just uh, right in front of it, if I'm not mistaken. But you can play as, for example, the uh, the Nazis, Russian soldiers, English soldiers, and there are battles that actually play out in big cities. And I'm talking about like cities with fucking skyscrapers and stuff. I don't know if it's actually you know reality based or just sort of loosely tied in. I guess the la the latter. But um, it made me realize that I was talking about that one thing that is so cool about. Hold on, please don't crash. Good. One thing that is so cool about Mountain Blade is that mod-wise, there, there are so many different mods out there. There is, you know, Star Wars like this. There is Lord of the Rings. There is Rome, uh, you know, ancient Rome. There, oh god, okay, we're gonna attack. There is Cowboys, Napoleonic Age. Um, but one thing that I thought of when I saw that the other day is what's not there. And it's kind of difficult, I guess, to really do well, but it's a Mafia-style one. That is something that I would like. It would be pretty difficult to pull off because you don't have a whole lot of different sort of units, you know, in Mafia. You can maybe have, like, a guy with a Tommy gun, got it with a revolver, got it with a baseball bat. But sort of have these urban-style war uh, combat. There is a mod, actually, which it's already stopped, I think, but it's from the anime High School of the Dead. And it's, uh, it's okay. Uh, but... Nothing special, but it has also combat in urban environments, and it's really cool. Especially if you have, uh, you know. Well, so much for that. Especially if you have the battle sizer and have big battles. Oh god. See Anela. Doing some good job. Somebody, by the way, said in the comments that I should recruit Boba Fett. That is a little difficult. That is, uh. It's a little difficult. Maybe if I capture him and talk to him. Don't know if that's a possibility. Okay, here we go. Seven killed. Uh, yeah, obviously Dusok. Okay, hold on. Well, that oh that doesn't do shit. Uh, fuck it. Ready to upgrade. There we go. Uh, yeah, okay. So how many do we have now? 76. We actually got a long way ahead in terms of recruiting. Obviously, because some of those hero units that I just recruited have some skills into, like, tracking and stuff, that's why we now see this. These are obviously our, my own tracks. Still hot. 
cooling off over here. It's mostly useful if you hunt a specific target down, which is something I don't I rarely do. Hmm. Not very generous in terms of offering me fucking uh Unions. How's Dagaba doing? Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go here, see if they have maybe a mission for me, since I need to kind of like, uh, better my relationship with that planet. Because, you know, recruiting from there is impossible at the moment, since they hate me so much. Probably say probably have some crap like, oh, we need boxes of grain or nerf stuff and blah blah blah. See, boom. Uh, you have a mission. My good star plan has been going through such a hardships. See how much grain, god damn it. God fucking damn it. And I don't do those kind of missions because they're just stupid. I have 90 right now. Right now. Uh, okay, let's look at Dagba. No, actually, I'm not. I've... Hoth, of course, is what I meant. Hey, that stars again in. Wait! Oh, it's under siege now. Look, it, it looks like the huts are still still battling it out right there. They are not playing nice. That is for sure. What's happening here? Jabba is on. Um, okay. <sighs> um. Yeah, that's gonna crash, huh? Let's see, the battle is on Endor, if I do that. I don't want to. Nah, fuck it. Oh, look at that. What up, Greedo? You want a battle? No? <laughs> ah, I was afraid of that. Okay. Kind of interesting. Forty-six is deserves. Uh, wow. Are they? They're attacking me. Wow. Arrogant sons of bitches. Yeah, shit. Even though their units do not have. Units on bikes. I'll still fight here. Come on, Kyle. We need your lightsaber, boy. Oh, there he is. Kyle the man, boy. Slaughter them. Oh, there we have, uh, what the fuck is it? Anela? Anela? That's the fucking difficult name. Job. Well done, everybody. Five were killed. Pretty good. 
Oh, hey. Guess who's getting that? Do, 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 do. Uh, does that actually require... No, 